If you guys are looking for the cheapest and most reliable coins on the market, make sure to head over to utnice.com and use code CHIEF for 6% off at checkout. Now let's go ahead and jump right into this video. What's up guys, it's Feeve Chief here and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we have for you episode 9 of the FIFA 22 Road to Glory series. Now if you guys are enjoying the content or you are new around here, I ask that you do please drop a like on the video and subscribe to the channel. I really do appreciate it and it helps me out a ton. And then make sure to check out all those links in the description like Twitch for all my daily live streams, Discord for all sorts of trading advice and investments and all the other links down there as well. And with that said, let's go ahead and jump right into this episode. So guys, kicking it off here, we have an objective pack from the Milestones. We've gone ahead and played 25 squad bat battles matches on minimum semi-pro difficulty. So we get a two rare gold players pack there, which we're going to pull Kevin De Bruyne out of. And then after that, we have our division rivals rewards here. So from this, we can either get a jumbo premium gold players pack untradeable, a small rare gold players pack and a thousand coins. We can take an untradeable 45k pack or a tradable 45k pack. And I feel like the move here is definitely this one at the end, the untradable jumbo premium gold players. So we get 24 gold players, seven being rare, half a 50k pack tradable and a thousand coins. So I think we're going to rock with that one. I'm tempted to take the 45k pack and 16,000 coins, but I think we're going to roll the dice here and fill the club up. So we're going to go with option number three here. I'm so tempted to take those 16,000 coins, but we're going to get over it and test our pack luck, which isn't the greatest idea in the world considering what our pack luck has been like, but you know what we're about here. So let's go ahead, jump over to our store here. We'll start it off with the two untradeable packs. I mean, if we just got a Phil Foden, man, that would be electric. A first owner Phil Foden for the squad. All right, let's see what we get here. It is going to be boards out of the two-player pack. English goal. We get Nick Pope there. We will take that for sure. We will 100% take a Nick Pope and a Team of the Week card. Look at that right there. That is a hell of a two-player pack. Nick Pope and Van Amsvert dirt dirt all right next pack all right here we go next up we got an untradeable jumbo premium gold players pack give us a walk out here it's not a walkout it is boards though it's gonna be sommer he's 85 rated that's not too bad there can we get some 84s and 83s in here as well give us some nice fodder we get a john stones in there who isn't a bad card at all um, AUR, Herrera, I mean, it's a lot of stuff that is going to be relatively cheap, but some good cards at the end of the day, we'll send all those into the club, and we've got a Lamar, a Rakitic, and okay, all tradable, that is perfect, we'll send those up to the transfer list for now, and then next up here, tradable 50k pack, this is where we want something big here, we, this is what we want, Something big. Come on, EA. Tradable pack. It's not a walkout, but it is a board. Columbia striker. It's Zapata, 83 rated. We need an Edder Militao in here, basically. It has to be an Edder Militao in here. Come on. Should have taken the 16,000 coins. Should have taken the 16,000 coins, boys. But moving on, some more stuff in the transfer list there. The club's absolutely stacked, and we do have... A preview pack here so we can go ahead and preview this let's see what's in this 5k pack come on ea bless us absolutely nothing in there so rough start to the episode wow we got seven players in that 7.5k pack that's kind of crazy that might actually be profit depending on what those go for but that's going to wrap it up for this first part the goal for this episode is still grinding squad battles we're five games in with this squad for getting loyalty on it so we're using it in squad battles we need to play five more games and then once we've played 10 games we'll have loyalty on those players and we'll be able to complete league and nation hybrid here so we'll get ourselves a rare mega pack and how many coins is it here 13,000 coins so nice little boost to the club there and marquee matchups is out so I'm guessing we're gonna just go and complete those as well so quite a few things to do today uh squad battles SBCs all that so we'll catch you guys in a second all right guys we are back and we've got quite a few things to go through here 
First off, we went ahead and played all of our squad battles matches to the point where we got loyalty on all the players we needed. So we're able to go ahead and complete the league and nation hybrid right here. As you can see, we're up to 87 cam on it. And again, wasn't a very expensive squad at all. So we'll go, go ahead and submit that to get ourselves a rare mega pack, which is a really, really nice boost to the uh, to our kind of pack haul that we're getting in the last like couple hours, basically four ones to watch and then we go ahead and we get 13,000 coins for completing that whole set right there which is very very exciting give us some more coins to kind of invest with and kind of upgrade the team with which we'll get to in a second here actually so and then we get this kit which you know really doesn't matter we'll go ahead and just send that into the club so all we have left here marquee matchups came out I'm gonna do those tomorrow before ones to watch so I have them for that right when it starts and we'll be live on stream when once to watch starts with a little pack opening um in terms of objectives here we completed just a squad battles uh thing and an assist mastery thing so we go ahead and get another pack here 275 to 83 rated players so <clears throat> we've got a decent haul of packs here we're gonna save all of just like the normal packs for tomorrow when ones to watches are in packs but we do in fact have our guaranteed ones to watch player here so we'll have that for tomorrow which is very very exciting cannot wait for that gonna be a good time now looking over to our coin balance we're down to about seventy nine thousand coins as you may see there now where have our coins gone the squad is currently the exact same basically let me go over to the main squad here all right, so here is the squad. This is the main squad here. Sorry, things kind of cut out for a second. But this is the squad, still the exact same. A lot of our investments like Tony, Jekko, Bunu, and Barella are already up in price, which is very, very exciting. So we're making coins on those already. And basically what I went through and did is I've invested in a bunch of 83 rated cards, and I'm still going to go through and invest in a bunch of 84 rated cards as well. I really like the price of fodder right now. It's so cheap and it can't really go much lower. So I think we've there's great potential to invest in those cards at the moment. So that's where I'm kind of at with that at the moment big fan of of the fodder market right now it may take a while for it to go up in price but i do like the way it looks right now things are super cheap and no reason to really sit on a ton of liquid coins which is why i am currently investing in a bit of fodder and then i've done some trading as well you'll see a video on this later today when this is uploaded what exact method i was using here but very very simple method just some chem style trading on players and then a little bit of position modifier flipping for some easy coins as well so some simple stuff there but the plan right now is to wait for ones to watch tomorrow we're going to continue to try and get our squad battles done so that we can get 50k packs for sunday hopefully get elite one in squad battles and then do marquee matchups to get those packs as well we need to pack either jack Grealish or gabriel jesus when they're in packs we just need it but squad battles we're up to about thirteen and a half thousand points here still got a long ways to go to get to elite one which is already at 30k here it's probably gonna hit 40 by sunday so we got a lot of work in squad battles to do which we'll be doing this weekend so got that to do to keep us busy and what's this squad that we got to play look like? That is a solid team right there. So going to be a lot of work there. We went ahead and did another draft on stream and I lost in the first round. It was an absolute nightmare. So I am very much tempted to use the rest of our FIFA points on 7.5k packs to get our, um, basically to just get our coin balance up as quickly as possible so we can keep investing. So I think we might go ahead and do that tomorrow. So lots of packs coming tomorrow gonna be a big episode for us and yeah so that's just kind of the plan as of right now but that's gonna be it for this episode guys if you did enjoy it make sure to like comment and subscribe and i'll catch you in the next video